Hi, in this video, I will teach you a problem from exercise 11.2, which is a quite confusing problem for most of the students. So let us uh, start with the problem now. Draw a circle of radius 3 cm. Take two points P and Q on, uh, on one of its extended diameter, each at a distance of 7 cm from its center. Draw the tangent to the circle from this two points P and Q. So let us draw a circle of radius 3 cm. Take two points P and Q on one of its extended diameter each at a distance of 7 cm. So first let us draw the diameter of this circle. Let us extend the diameter to mark a point P which is 7 cm away from the center of the circle. Similarly, let us take point Q 7 cm away from the center of the circle which is on the left side of the circle. So let us follow the steps to draw the uh, tangent to the circle. Bisect the line PO and QO and find the midpoints. So now let us draw the perpendicular bisector for the line OP. As we need to draw the four tangents and we have two lines here OP and OQ. So we need to draw the separate perpendicular bisector for the line OP and then OQ. Let us draw perpendicular bisector for the line OP. Measure more than half of the distance of OP and keep your compass at point P and draw an arc one above the line OP and one below the line OP. Similarly, let us uh, keep our compass at point O and draw an arc one above the line OP and one below the line OP which is intersecting with the previous arc that you have drawn. So now similarly you need to draw the perpendicular bisector for the line OQ. So for that again you need to measure more than half of the distance but anyways both the lines are equal as it is 7 cm on both the sides. So with the same measurement you can keep your compass and draw the perpendicular bisector. So keep your compass at point O and draw one arc above the line OQ and one uh, arc below the line OQ. Without altering the distance in your compass, now keep your compass at point Q and draw an arc above and below the line intersecting the previous arc. Now join the intersection points to get a perpendicular bisector of OQ and OP. Now let us mark this intersection point as M1 and this intersection point as M2. You need to take M1 as a center and OM1 or M1P as a radius and draw a circle. Similarly, take M2 as a center and draw a circle for this also. Let us mark this intersection point as T1, T2 and here T3 and T4. Now join PT1, PT2, QT3 and QT4 to get all the four tangents.
so here t1 p t2 p t3 q and t4 q are the required tangents if they have not asked you to measure so no need to measure here the tangents that's it for now in the next video i am going to teach you a very important tangent related problem where the angle between the tangent is given to you and you need to draw the tangent to the circle and please don't forget to like share subscribe and press the bell icon